Hey all, and let's talk about some Walheim base building. Today I'm gonna showcase how I did build my very first tree base. I've never done this before, I haven't seen zero guides, and I wanna want to show you how the reality looks like and how I did to build my own base. And also, let me know, have you tried it, tried it out? Have you ever tried to build um, a, a base up in the trees because that's what we're gonna do and also I will uh, showcase a few of the sh uh, uh, challenges in the video um, I can actually say them right away so you know if you want to try out to build something yourself first it's quite expensive wood wise so before you before you start uh, gather some wood then you don't have to run back and forth Two, don't chop down the trees that you're building your base in. Or don't have that friend that's <laughs> chopping down the tree where your base is. Because we all have that one friend, right? And three, it's hard to see. Uh, you know, when the tree goes... Then it... Uh, it goes root, root, root. <laughs> branches, breaches. Okay, I, I, I have a, I don't remember the right word, but you understand what I mean. It, it will block the sight and it's uh, hard to aim. And also when you're so high up in the trees, when uh, you might fall down and die because you don't have a line of sight. And also, Fourth, if you build in uh, Black Forest, you might get company, especially at night. And also, this is a bonus. If you want to have a sleeping spot in the treehouse, you uh, the bed has to be uh, be close to a fireplace, and that will also be an issue. So. Yeah, I did solve all of this in, in the video. So, if you want to, uh, I have put uh, chapters where you can uh, click. Uh, I have highlighted where I do the different things. And uh, also, if you watch everything through, you will learn how to build your very own treehouse. Okay, let's jump in. So, here I am sitting in my tree house but before i show you the rest look at the view this is what i enjoy the most was building a, a tree house the view is amazing and this is the, a small teaser and now let's watch how i did build this huge tree base Okay, hi and welcome and let's get going with some base building. Today we're gonna try to make a tree treetop house to basically build a base up in the air connected it to trees. So yeah, sit down, relax and let's get going. My name is Rusa and uh, I'm a variation streamer and a YouTuber and I'm uh, making beginner guides for complete potatoes. So. Welcome in. These trees, um, pine trees, uh, they don't have so many um, branches, maybe it's called. So I will uh, build within these trees and I try to connect it somehow. So the first thing what we want to do is put this workbench in here. And now we want to place down these. Um, we need to get up somehow and uh, up, maybe, maybe take these. So yeah, uh, when we're building in Black Forest, uh, there might be a few great wires that wants to come and visit. But anyhow, uh, we're picking our hammer and I think we will take the wood ladder. And we can turn it. 
We could uh, make it like this. So, yeah, this works as a foundation. And the big question is, how much further up in the air do we want to go? Do we ha uh, want a certain depth if we fall down? Yes. And I promise I won't fall down to my <laughs> death. Okay, I can't promise anything, but we will try. Okay, we're getting it start. So we're trying it to get a nice fit. Uh, switching it to a smaller pieces and uh, if we go to the hammer uh, so far so good i think uh, it's a uh, quite solid surface so far so now we want to grab another three hmm Oh yeah, uh, the issue is uh, when everything is so narrow. <laughs> As you can see, some of the issues are when you're building up in trees is to get the snapping correct. And also, that's an issue that they are destroying the workbench. So we will put a workbench up here. There we go. So uh, that's what I'm doing right now. Uh, by building a wall to the side, um, I can uh, easier get uh, the snapping uh, to work more properly. And now we have the, have the wall. We, we can uh, get floor to snap so therefore ah oh, it's not re uh, really even hmm oh well uh, we might have to live with that when we are up in the tree <laughs> oh yeah it's a, a small overlap i'm uh, using uh, ladders to get further away from it uh, the, the tree and I can uh, get better snapping. So the issue will be the, the fire fireplace, but I have an alternative solution. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to press the thumbs up button because that helps me spread this video to other beginners um, for Valheim, that how to build a tree house. I just want every single potato to be uh, able to build their own house. If I can do it, you can do it. So yeah, be sure, thumbs up, and see you in the forest. Yeah, as you can see, uh, from time to time we're getting a uh, company from uh, random gray dwarves that's uh, attacking uh, the structures. So then we just have to go down and deal with them. So we will take the hammer, if you choose repair, and boom, it's repaired. 
And you can also see some of the structure is decaying over time. It's because it's a lacking roof, so but that's work in progress. But yeah, it's a uh, uh, it's a little bit since uh, you saw the latest update to how everything looks. So let's uh, let's see how the base is looking it right now. Uh, we have uh, made uh, multiple entries. Uh, these platforms are a work in progress, and uh, yeah, this is actually. Uh, me trying to get to the other side so we can uh, we can uh, easily work and make it to uh, more neat so but this is a side of pro object oh yeah that's uh, attached for you and so it's a more stable but yeah this is how it looks right now uh, this is uh, like the outer terrace I don't know if I want to cut this out and make it a little bit smaller um, because it's uh, so much wood. So and this is uh, still a work in progress. So, but uh, let's go inside. So here we have the workbench, and uh, here we also have. <laughs> it's uh, actually the chimney, and uh, we can go down. So, uh, where, we, where we are hiding the bed, actually. As uh, you can see here, we have a fire. And here goes the chimney. And we had some issues to actually find the place where the chimney fits. Oh, yeah. I made gates. And it's still a work in progress, so you can't really judge. But uh, this is how it looks right now. And as I said, it's a work in progress. It's uh, looking a little bit funky, but it's I'm trying to get a supportive structure for the upper floor. And uh, if you look around a little bit, we can see um, some pieces have decayed a little bit. So we need to watch out because I didn't really get a roof early on, but now it's starting uh, to punish us. And... Uh, yeah, you can see uh, some of the bad stuff with building in trees. Um, and it, it blocks the site for for you to have proper builds and such. But anyway, let's take these. Mm, or maybe I don't want these. So yeah, before I show you how the base turned out, I want to show you my main base. That I've been working with and uh, everything I've been doing solo and I had haven't had too much time but I made a mod my own bridge uh, okay OCD people will have some issues with this <laughs> and then we come here we have some uh, extra gates uh, watchtowers you can see um, it's uh, taking damage do you know uh, and that's because would take damage if you don't repair it no because there's no roof but yeah uh, yeah we had some accidents in the house and what I wanted to show you is I made a basement while the house was standing now, but it actually turned out pretty well and uh, it looks like this and uh, I'm, I'm thinking I want to make this my storage yeah it's a little bit traditional i know but i will show you a trick you see i have signs so if i take this i can't place signs on on the chest itself and i will also show you how to stack them so first we place down our chest and to be able to stack I will actually take a small wood, boom, and now, ta-da, that's how you stack, and when it comes to the signs, okay, bad timing, out of wood, okay, the first one is placed on the floor. And the next one is actually placed on, on the wood. 
So yeah, that's why and how you use the wooded pallet underneath the chests. So that's how you stack them and how you get, get nice signs on your chests. If you, uh, you can uh, then just press E and name your chest S stuff. And it will be there. Okay, this is how my base looks like. And uh, I must say it looks darn fine. And if you haven't done it already, be sure to smash that like button and to show the YouTube algorithm that this Walheim video is worth seeing. Oh yeah, I need to wear my cape. There we go. And this is where everything started. Uh, I made multiple platforms, like you can see there is some structure left underneath that I used. And if I were you, I would make uh, multiple levels because uh, you can use the sportive structure to go higher up later on. And here we go. Oh yeah. So as you can see, uh, the house is fabulous from this side as well. Um, the fireplace is a little bit shady. Can you guys tell me why it's not burning? Uh, it has fuel, but sometimes it just puts itself out. And here we have gates. I think this is pretty cool. And uh, there is uh, just one ladder here, so I can uh, sneak underneath. So, uh, as I said, there is uh, some beams in the way, but it's work in progress. And as I said, it's my first ever um, um, free house base. And I think uh, this could fit well. I could uh, smoosh in, uh, for example. There we go. Okay, I don't have wood. Hmm, you know what? I, w I just want to show you something. We, we don't need this. <laughs> we don't need that reeling. I want to show you something. We, we, we could actually put this on the wall or, or, or the roof. So I think this is, could uh, actually work darn fine when it comes to stuffing. Oh, yeah. Did I put it up backwards? Oh yeah, I did. Oh yeah, there we go. So this is what I meant with it. This could be pretty darn good. So um, I can put uh, these signs on the roof. And I know exactly where I use everything. And as I said, here we could have put uh, a nice chair. Shell with the view. I must say, it's goddamn beautiful. If you learned anything about three houses today, smack that uh, like button. Tell YouTube that well, this was a beautiful home. And let me know down in the comments have you tried three houses or if did this video make you want to try out three houses let me know and uh, i will tweak this a little bit more and let me know what kind of base should we try next thank you for watching and see you soon